So my mount came off, well it didn't come off, but um, it's kind of loose. So I took it back in the house and I put in a different kind of tape. So I scraped off the tape that it came with and I put in this double-sided tape from 3M's. So and then I cut around it with scissors to make it a circular shape. So I'm gonna try to apply it again here and see if it will stay better than um, the, the tape that it came, uh, came with. So let me try to mount this. Um, the goal is to mount my 12.9 inch iPad Pro here, just to make it look uh, a little fancy. Peel this off and apply it onto the dash. So make sure you clean the dash first before you apply it, so to make sure that it will adhere to it better. Since my iPad Pro is pretty big, 12.9, I have to make sure that this in here will be enough length. And I measured it already, so I know it will work. The good thing about this is I bought a roll of double-sided tape, so if it comes off again, um, I just redo it and make sure that I um, place it in the right area because right now I placed it at, on a curved edge so you can see there might be um, gaps and that might affect the mount so usually when you mount something like this just let it stay for about five minutes but since I'm I don't want to wait I'm just gonna try to mount it right away so as you can see this is my the back of my iPad um, to make sure that the magnet works 100% Put it outside the case and another good thing about this is if you put it outside the case you can just replace the case instead of put it in on the iPad itself and then you have to clean the iPad when you when you take the magnet out so take the metal out so right now I have this so from this this magnet and this magnet would uh, fit on the Subaru and from this magnet this magnet would fit on the Honda so I want to make sure that I will fit both both the car that we have so what I usually do is I attach one first and then I'll align the other one. Something like that. So that will stay. It does stay really well, uh, even when I drive fast or on a um, rough area. This thing won't move because it's, it's so strong. The reason why this works on an uneven surface is because this thing can swivel. See, this, this, this thing right here, you can actually take off and this is just a ball so it will uh, conform to the uh, flat iP iPad case that's why I put one in first and the other one would just connect along with it I place my fingers behind it to see if it's flat so that's how I mount my magnet the good thing about this doing this is you don't have to replace your whole stereo because I know um, that's what I want to do before is replace this whole thing and try to make it fit certain tablet because this thing it will this thing is pretty small so to fit this I have to get something like around seven inches of tablet to make it fit and that would just uh, hurt my car and maybe later on when I want to sell this car I uh, it might devalue the car more so this way it won't hurt the car uh, I just when I want to sell it or you know move on I just remove the the mount the, the magnets which is very easy to remove just peel it off uh, well it's not not that easy but uh, but it won't uh, damage the car because the 3m tapes is pretty pretty safe on plastic and and metals uh, on, wo on wood um, especially those cardboard wood it will peel off the the, 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 the top layer but here it, it will do fine so that's how I mount my tablet. Yeah.